My name is Lindsay Tobin, and I'm a senior graphic design student at the University of Kansas. My favorite thing about Kansas City is probably the people. I think everyone is just so supportive, whether that is of small businesses or local artists, and it's just a very inspiring and uplifting community that you know will always have your back. As a young artist, I think it can be really difficult to classify my work by just one style. I strive to find a balance between using bright colors or illustrative elements with intricate and feminine touches. I pull a lot of inspiration from my surroundings or the environment that I'm in, as well as music. I try to emulate those feelings into the work that I produce. I want my work to be very purposeful with every decision being made with intention. That way people can connect with the message that I am trying to convey. When I'm creating a font, I always start with the basics. So as you can see here, I'm just using a couple of letters to kind of explore different styles. And this is just something that kind of helps me get the basic idea out of the way. And then you can go into Illustrator and create the entire font later on. Creating a font can feel really intimidating at first when you see the entire alphabet, all the punctuation and the numbers together. But one of the reassuring things is that there are multiple parts of a letter that can be applied to other letters in the alphabet. For instance, this part of the N is actually the same part on the H. And it kind of just makes the process go by a lot smoother when you see that there are multiple parts of a letter that can be applied throughout the alphabet. 